Hello, this is Barry Beer. Welcome to Friday, the 22nd of February. Thanks for joining me here this afternoon on my video about staying positive and respecting people's wishes if they decide to move on from the previous job. Firstly, I would like to give you all some tips about how to stay positive if you're feeling upset or down. And the first one is if you're having a negative thought, pick it up and throw it in the garbage bin. The second thing if you are having a negative moment, take some time out of your day to go for a walk and get rid of the negative thing that is bothering you. Three, never hold on to negative things. Throw them away as if they don't exist. Four, go for a drive in your car. Listen to a nice radio station such as Smooth or 2CH or listen to a compact disc. There is nothing wrong with staying positive, but don't mix the positives, guys, with the negatives because the negatives and the positives, they don't mix. We all get upset and have bad days, but hey, what's the point of wasting your life if you've been negative all the time? Think about it. Perhaps you'd like to do some homework, homework and write down a few points about how to stay positive over the weekend if it's going to be a rainy day. You've got all weekend to do it. And if, you, if you've got time whilst you're out, get a notepad and a, a pen and write down a few points about how you would stay positive if you're having a negative moment. Because negative and positive, no, it just doesn't um, mix. So, what are you going to do if you've got a negative thought? Pick it up and throw it in the bin. Don't ever hold a negative thing inside you. Get it out of you. Let someone know what what is bothering you and why you are feeling negative in the first place. Is having all those negative thoughts, guys? No, no, it doesn't work. So, grab a pen and paper, switch off the TV, send the kids out of the room, and have some time to yourself to write down some positive things. You can even do this down at the beach whilst you are alone. Because having some private time to yourself, if you are feeling upset about something, really does do the trick. And go down to the beach too and do some homework and write down on a notepad how you can encourage yourself to stay positive and take a portable radio too with a couple of spare batteries and listen to a nice calm radio station to help you get rid of the negative thoughts that you have inside you and bring a friend along too if you wish 
that help you get things off your chest and to get rid of the negatives that you've got. But what if you make it work? So why not give it a try this weekend or when you when you've got a day off coming up and it's nice weather. Take you and your friend down to the beach and have some good quality fish and chips and have a good long chat about what is bothering you and also write down where you are and what time you are at that place and the destination. So why not give it a try? Hmm? Because you only have the one life to get rid of the negatives and start bringing in the positive stuff. Now I would like to talk about respecting people's wishes if they decide to leave. We should feel happy that some when people have decided to move on or they're going back to school or university and also congratulating them and acknowledging people and wishing them the best of luck because if I was doing something or moving on from St. Ives Cat people would congratulate me and say good luck. So, if you're feeling upset about one of your work colleagues leaving, don't think about it in a negative way. Be happy for them and congratulate them and acknowledge them and wish him or her good luck. And Talk to your your work manager about it and maybe he or she will be able to find a way to help you stay positive instead of feeling upset. And that is it from me from the, for the moment. I will be back with you later on to bring you another video, this time on Meatwatch.